f of x equals this function here. Show that f of x equals this in simplified form. The curve C has equation y equals f of x. The point P, minus 1, minus 5 over 2, lies on C. Find an equation of the normal to C at P. So I've got the equation here. That's uh, how I've got this first part then, part A. Now you'll notice that this is the difference between two squares, x minus 3, x plus 3. There's an x minus 3 um, on the first term as well, so we can take that outside a bracket. So we've got 1 over x minus 3 common to both, so let's put that there. And what have we got inside? We've got 4x minus 5, still there. We've got the 2x plus 1 there. And on the second term we've got minus uh, 2x, we've taken out the x minus 3, so that's just going to leave the x plus 3, isn't it? Now I've left plenty of room for good reason, because I'm going to put the same denominator here. So for this to be the same as that denominator-wise, I'm going to need an x plus 3, aren't I? So we need this, uh, there and there. And to make this the same as that, of course, we need the 2x plus 1, don't we, there and there. So that's what we've got. So let's just tidy this up then. So that's equal to 1 over the x minus 3 here. And then what have we got? We've got 4x squared on the top. Then we've got plus 12 minus 5 is plus a 7x. Oh, plus 12 minus 5 is 7x. And then plus and the minus is a minus 5, 3 is a 15. Now it's the same denominator, so I can just carry that line over. The denominator while we're at it is x plus 3 times 2x plus 1, and then we've got minus, so we have to carry that through both terms, 2x times 2x is minus 4x squared, and then minus 2x times 1 is minus 2x, close the brace, that's what we've got then. So let's just write down what this is, this is 1 over x minus 3, and then we've got 4x squared and a 4x squared minus cancels, 7x minus 2x is 5x, minus 15. Now there's a 5 common, so I'm going to take that out straight away. 5x minus 15, so I need an x minus 3 here, don't, don't we? And underneath we've got, I'm going to write it around the other way, because that's what it has in the question. 2x plus 1 times the x plus 3. So that's equal to then. Uh, the x minus 3 now will cancel top and bottom, we're just left with 5 over and then it will be the 2x plus 1 that's left underneath times the x plus 3. And that's what we wanted uh, for our problem. So the curve, the point P, is on C. Find an equation of the normal to C at P. So we've got minus 1 minus 5 over 2. We want the equation of the normal. Well, the gradient is F dashed. Now, to write this as, <coughs> to differentiate, the best thing to do here is just write this, expand this bracket. So here, F of x is equal to 5 over this 2x squared and then it's 6x plus 1x is plus 7x and then we've got 1 times 3 is 3 so this is easy to differentiate in this form isn't it? so that implies f dashed of x then it's something to the minus 1 isn't it? so the minus 1 comes to be with the 5 to make minus 5 there's something to the minus 2 so it's over squared so the minus 2 is the squared, is how we write it. And then multiplied by, is a function of a function, so there's something differentiated. 4x plus 7. So I'll put that here. Multiplied by 4x plus 7. So it was power minus 1, wasn't it? So the minus 1 came up to the power minus 2, which we can write underneath as squared. Multiplied by the something differentiated, which differentiated to 4x plus 7. So when x is minus 1, f dashed, this was um, f dashed of minus 1 then, is equal to minus 5 on top. This is minus 1 here, minus 4 plus 7 is 3, 7 to 8, 4 is 3. Here we've got 2, minus 1 squared is 1, 2 times 1 is 2, 7 times minus 1 is minus 7, then we've got a plus 3 squared. So it's minus 15 on the top then. We've got 5, take away 7 is minus 2 squared, which is 4. So there's our gradient of tangent. So the normal, the normal gradient of P is 
Well, it would be 4 over 15, invert it, and then drop a minus, flip the sign, because this times this must give a product of minus 1, so it's 4 fifteenths. Uh, so, uh, equation of normal then? At P is, and then we can just write Y minus, the Y value, which was minus 5 over 2, wasn't it? It goes through the point P, so it's plus 5 over 2 is equal to the gradient, which is 4 fifteenths, um, x minus the x value at p, which is minus 1. So that flips that to a plus 1. So there's two minuses. And then we can tidy that still further if we want to. y equals expand the bracket 4x over 15. And then it's plus 4 fifteenths minus 5 over 2. And you can work out that fraction in your calculator if you want to. y equals 4x over 15 and this is 30 isn't it 30th 30th 8 30th 15 75 8 30th minus 75 8 minus 75 is minus 67 over 30 that's the equation of the normal